crazy seeing it like this. It looks so jacked with no uh, over fenders. It's like you're a, like a organ donor. I am an organ donor. Might as well be. Donor car. Oh, last time you guys saw me, um, I was getting self corrected by, uh, <laughs> who was it again? Erica Nagashima. That's right, Erica Nagashima. She's 10 minutes away from here if you want to try again. Light turned green, sorry. No, let me in. Let me in. It's locked. Open the door. <laughs> oh my gosh. What's up, guys? Uh, my name is James Krosniak. At that half Japanese guy, hit me up. <laughs> I had to make up for that panic. Yeah, that was great. All right, onward to Seattle! I'm lost. All right, so we're in Riverside, California. We've got the rear end with us that we picked up in Glendale, and we're meeting with Nick Marhuis. He's gonna help us with uh, building the rear end since Rome had to leave for San Diego. Hey. How you doing? <laughs> Good to meet you. Good to meet you too. Uh, James, nice hey. to meet you. Hey, James. Um, just drive straight forward. This is great. Look at this. This is great. Great. Right. What a yard. Yeah, if you want to drive up yeah. and then back in the other end. Okay. Yeah. Like back the trailer? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, just reverse the whole thing. Yeah. And then, uh, Here you can hop on. You want me to step out and uh, record oh. the oh, car? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Yeah. Yeah, no worries. Idea. We're just going to keep these accents between ourselves. Yep. You can really see them. All of a sudden, we're back to English. <laughs> snapping tortoise? Nah, I don't know. I, I don't touch it, but like, it's pretty chill. <laughs> Random out. I've never seen like a stray tortoise. He doesn't look very happy. 
you want to introduce yourself? Oh yeah, uh, I'm Nick Marcus, uh, owner of Airbag Trailers. How do you say your last name? Marcus. Marcus. Yeah. Stash. Like in English, if I was English, would I say Marcus? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We don't. I mean, I'm from New Zealand, so we don't pronounce our R's. Yeah. And you own Airbag Trailers. Yep. Yep. So these are my creation. Uh, and yeah, build them here in California at the moment and looking to start this year on the East Coast. So, awesome. Um, yeah, I fly forward and back from New Zealand a lot. Yeah. <laughs> um, and then and, yeah, and how did we meet? Do you remember? I don't even know. Oh, Through right. the internet. Was it after you got your trailer stolen and yep. you messaged? Yeah. We're trying to hook up Daniel with an airbag trailers because yep. he makes the coolest trailers in the world and they're very expensive so it's kind of a difficult thing to swing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So like we want to cut like where it's got this big dent right here. Yeah. Like right in front of it. Okay. We'll, we'll cut okay. this. Now the tricky part. Just go here and just because if it comes up here. Well, we, we're still going to see this. Seen some faces that I'll never know. I keep dancing but it's just a show. Build the um, the fuel cell cage, mm -hmm. and then at the end we're gonna have two mounting plates mm -hmm. where there's gonna be a bar that attaches. Okay. Yep. And then ideally we can take some steel, uh, what would you call it, like like wire or really small thin like rod. So, yeah, rod. We'll take like rod to support the, tip of the rear end. Okay. That will be the support of the rear end as opposed to like a mangled unibody. Yeah, yeah, you know. Yeah. Um. So, I presume the plan is to get the fuel cell as low and forward as possible. Yes. So we have something like that in the trunk of the car. It's my 3D <laughs> drawing skills getting put to test. <laughs> and then we have. Uh, I'm thinking. Something. So you're an industrial designer too, are you? Those will be the, the... So that, yeah, this is just simple concepts at the moment. But, like I was saying, like, because we can't extract it upwards, right? Because you've got the, you've got the um, top limiting it. We, the... we have, so, we've we got some room. we got quite oh. a lot of room to lift it up. Especially if it's placed right there. We can lift it up a full eight inches before it hits anything. This would only go this high so that you can kind of like tilt it this way and just pull it out. Yeah. You know what I mean? It definitely has to be strong. Yeah, that's, that's with, the thing. Because with that fuel cell. Yeah, something that like came forward and then kind of went down under it and then up. It's like you've got like bend, bend, bend. Not bend, but like, you know, like corner, corner, corner.
pretty strong. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good test. Same thing, I couldn't really see you go out like, well easily. Yeah. But, I mean, I got them in there, so. Dude, awesome. Yes! Got a Yeah. <clears throat> Here it is out in the sun. Look at that. So awesome. Hey, bud. Hey, buddy. Thanks. All right, Nick. All right. We're going to hit the road. See ya. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Bye, dogs. Sweet. Cheers, mate. See you next time. Well, what a legend. Yeah, man, he came by and saved the day. Nick. Nick. Night. Shining, shining armor. The night in shining armor. Night in shining armor, boys. All right, to Walmart. Yeah? To Walmart. Let's do it. Onward and upward. You walk, I'm out to the city, yeah. Girl, you know you coming with me, yeah. I'm being a hundred out of fifty, girl. Shoot free, cause I'm a bitch. <laughs>